She's probably got Can you trust a stranger? Cam Belder's new op shop is putting the question to the test. It has no staff and no cash register. Instead, customers transfer payments directly into the shop's bank account. Now, it's a little bit out there and people couldn't grasp it at first. Well, they were saying, there's a lot of dodgy people out there. And I was like, is there they? The concept came about because there were not enough volunteers to staff the charity shop all day, every day. What we do is we help struggling families pay their bills. And the criteria is you have to live in Cambelda and you have to be doing it hard. The shop's honesty system also allows customers to pay flexibly. If they need something, they can't afford on the day. You don't have the stress of having to walk into a shop and pay right then and there and going, oh, can I afford that? <laughs> and yeah, I just messaged Whitney saying, I'm taking this, I'll pay you when the partner gets paid. Security cameras are the only thing keeping an eye on the shop. But so far, it seems to be working. I knew it would, with all my heart, I knew it was going to work. Abandoned shop fronts have become the norm at Cambelda Plaza since the nickel price collapsed and mines closed. Now, the op shop is bringing some life back. It's nice, it's nice because there hasn't been many shops opened in the, in the arcade for a long time. It's nice, to, it's always colourful and makes the place happier. Yeah. On the inside, the shop is decorated with paintings by Mexican artist Frida Kahlo, Whitney's inspiration to help her community in times of need. So I love Frida Kahlo. Like she, she represents someone who's really strong. She's, she's been through a lot in her life. I guess kind of the same as me. So I was a single mother, no money, struggling. I would have loved to have a group back then to help me instead of just Centrelink saying no all the time. Just like a, a group that actually said, yes, 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 we can help you. Rhiannon Stevens, ABC News, Cambelda.